now we're going to attach our valve core removal tool to the system just make sure that it's nice and straight as you attach it to the system um, you'd hate to cross thread this also when you put the swivel fitting onto the machine do not use a tool just hand tighten it don't use a tool to tighten it further because you can compress that o-ring which will make it very difficult for you to get the valve core out Just make sure that's nice and tight and don't use a tool to tighten it. Now we'll shut the ball valve. Now it's important to note that as the ball valve is closed, that the valve stem actually can't go all the way in to reach the valve core tool because it's obviously going to hit the ball valve. So that ball valve needs to be in an open position before you can actually push the valve core stem all the way in so that it can grab that, that valve core. Now what we'll do is we'll basically start undoing that valve core very slowly. We'll just twist and it's important that you apply pressure towards the system while you're doing this. The reason for applying the pressure towards the system is just so that whatever pressure may still be in the system doesn't push the, the, the tool stem out. So you're pushing towards the system to sort of counteract the system pressure that might still be in there. Right, and now the next step is just to undo that stem by swivel so that we can remove that valve core from the system. And there she comes out nicely. There she is, fitting snug inside the tool. And because the bore valve is closed, the, isolate, the, the system is isolated from the actual uh, exit port.